what is going on guys welcome back to another video of notes application development in android studio using firebase in last video we designed the screen for the add notes activity where we have added title and content and also the validation so in this video we will add the functionality to add the notes to the firebase database successfully so let's get started now we have to save the note to firebase so to save the note to firebase first thing is we have to go to firebase and click on firebase firestore database so click on this firestore database we have to create a firestore database before adding any data so let's click on it so we are on test mode so i will go to start in test mode click on next you can set any location click on enable so as you can see we have successfully created a database so here it is written your database is ready to go just add data so that's it we can now add the data now we have to add the dependency for firestore so for that go to tools firebase here select a cloud fire store over here get start with cloud fire store add the cloud fire store sdk to your app click on it accept changes it will add the dependency now our dependency are added so you can close this now we can add the notes so before adding the notes we have note title and note content you can directly use the map and add to the database but i will recommend to use a model class so let's create a model class for note then we can add with that model class so go to our project new java class that will be note this will be our notes model so it will be note class so here we will add whatever the data is needed so first thing is we need a title so string title string content one more thing we will add is time when this note is created so i will use timestamp this class is from firebase it will be timestamp so these three things we will add to the note for that we have to create a getter and setter first and then constructor so right click generate constructor don't select anything you can create a empty constructor and also right click generate getter and setter select everything click on ok we have created the model class we can close this now now after validation we will add this to model class so let's create that model class note note equals to new note so note dot set title will be note title note dot set content will be note content note dot set timestamp will be so we will put the whatever the time is now so for that timestamp dot now that's it we have created the note model class now we can add this note to the firebase so for that i will create a method after this will be void save note to firebase which will take the note as an note it will take the note model class and it will save so we'll call this method from here save note to firebase that note we have just created so to save note to the firestore you should have some collection directly we cannot save over here so we should not create a single collection to add all the notes we will create one collection of notes so inside collection of note we will have all the documents so documents will have some id that will be user id so each user have different collection your notes will have your collection another person notes will have another collection so inside that we will create a my notes as a collection inside that collection we will add all the notes so let's do that in the code i will create a method in utility that will return a collection reference where we want to save the note so this will return a collection reference i will give the method name collection reference for notes so first thing we need is user id so for each user we should have user id so for that firebase user current user equals to firebase auth dot get instance dot get current user we have done this in login also so we have current user and with this current user id we will save to the database so we'll made a firebase firestore dot get instance dot collection this collection will be notes collection inside that we will have a document that will be unique to each so this document will have the use current user dot get uid so inside notes collection we have this document that is unique for each id and inside that we will create one more collection that will be my notes so inside notes collection we have unique id and inside that we have my notes collection where all notes will be there so we'll return this collection reference from here so now go to notes detail activity 
in Firebase method. So we have to save the note. So where we have to set the note in that collection as a document. This note is also a document. So we will write document reference, which will be document reference. And this document reference will get from that collection reference. Utility dot get collection reference for note dot document. So inside that my notes collection, we will create one document that will be our note. So in that doc, in this document, document reference dot set we have a set method which will set the data so set data will be our note so this will add the note to the database directly it will add the note but we have to know it is completed or failure or whatever so like the same way we will add on complete listener new on complete listener put semicolon over here so on complete we will check as always if task is successful if it is successful means notes is added note is added else note is not added so in note added we will show a message to the user that utility dot so toast note detail activity dot this message will be note added successfully and we will finish this activity so once note is added it will close this activity and get back to main activity now if it is not added i will copy this message and I will write failed while adding notes. If it fails, then we will show some message. So that's it. This will add the note to the Firebase and we can see that. So let's run it and test it. How we will add, run it. So I'm on main activity, add notes. First, I will not put any title. Let's click on okay. So it is saying title is required. I'll give the title, my first note. Content I will give, testing my first note in android app so let's click on ok and see what message it displays so note added successfully so we have this message and activity is also closed so let's check in the firebase either it is added or not let's go to firebase you can reload this page so as you can see our notes is added so as i have mentioned it will create a notes collection first inside that it will have a document that is unique to our id this is our id that you can check on authentication also this is our unique id if another user add it will come below here it will add list of document for all individual user so inside this we have my notes collection i have created that collection inside my notes we should have the document so as you can see on the code first we have notes collection uid as document my notes collection and then we have one more document that will be note document this is our note document so this is our note id i'll click on this as you can see here is my content here is the timestamp here is the title so we have successfully added the note to our database so if i add second note also it will add my note to my notes collection if new user added it add new document to this notes and then he has also my notes collection so that's it for this video in next video we'll design the main activity where we will add recycler view to display all the notes available in the firestore database so if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button if you have any doubts and queries please comment below i will reply for you please don't forget to click on subscribe button before going see you in the next video Bye bye